Hang on, y'all. Oh, what the f you dropping for? It's not going to you. Going to you. Right, and it might be time to transfer. Hey, what's up, guys? And welcome back to another episode of Just Back to Endless Uploads. Welcome to another episode of Camera and Freak Out. Today's show features some of the best public freak out videos caught on camera, entitled Karen's Totally Losing Their sh Him or Hope you guys enjoy the video. Yeah, I know we had the best show, man. I mean, if you just go and get her dog back out the car, yeah, that's fine. I don't care. But you're not I mean, even legally supposed to ask for that. I didn't ask you for nothing. I was just But it's okay. Car. Look, it ain't that big of a deal. Let's just go get his his I'm not, No, I'm not doing that. I just asked him to get off the car. And then they can't do nothing. But you, I have a disability. Okay. Mom? No. Okay, then I need something to sit on. Okay. I, I can't until I have something to sit on. No. Uh, so our next crazy Karen goes toe to toe with these fast food employees, and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full video, and I'm gonna definitely need you guys to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. Let's check it out. Uh, so our next crazy Karen's went toe to toe on this train, and that's when things got ugly, really quick. Let's check it out. No, what the hell, man? No, man, I want you to go to hell. I don't want you to go to Rumble! 
Next guy tried to bring his service dog into this Dunkin' Donuts, but things did not go the way he expected it to. Let's check it out. I just told you what I said. It's as if it's a service dog, only then that's allowed. And what did you ask me for? For a certificate. And by law, the only thing you can do is ask what she's a service dog for, if she's a service dog, and what she's for. She's not a service dog. How do you know? How do you know? How, how do you know that she's not a service dog? Thank you. Uh, so this next woman was trying to get her taxes done and felt like she was getting scammed and that's when things got ugly really quick so let's check this video out and i'm gonna definitely need you guys to let us know in the comments what would you do if you were in this crazy situation right here let's check it out Well, it is what it that is. That can't take my damn 
They can't take my land and my but, house and stuff away from me. I understand that, but you arguing with them is not going to get anywhere this point. I'm not arguing. The only thing I told him, don't come on my property. Well, you, you said to be able you don't to get want those niggas walking on your property. That's, That's what I said. Don't even worry about it. Well, look, it's really, really, that was like really rude. I apologize that you are uncomfortable with us being here, but we pay rent to be here. I have kids in there. They don't need to hear stuff like that. I'm not trying to be disrespectful. I'm talking to you in a nice, calm voice. Okay, and give you all your sort of reading with it. I'm not stealing. You said I had not some free. Check the video then. Did you say that? Okay, then I can call them and tell them that. I don't have to lie. I'm going to church. I'm not lying. You said I can have some things free. Yes, you did. You can check that report. Okay, so let them know about my experience and how you are as a manager. Okay, you're making me, you're pretty good job. Really? All right, so this next woman goes toe to toe with a crazy Karen neighbor who thinks she's jealous of her. Yeah, you can't make this up, guys. Let's shake it out. Be still. Whatever you want. <coughs> huh? Whatever you want. <coughs> Baby, come here. Oh, you, Baby, come you're, here. You're jealous. Baby, come here. You're only you're <coughs> a bitch. That's why. Uh, sure you're thing. jealous. Sure thing, ma'am. Huh? Oh, you're jealous because you're a bitch too. And you're feeling so bad because you're a bitch? Sure thing. Oh. Maybe? Maybe I should call police on you. Oh, call it. I can call you a bitch too because you're full of jealous. I mean, there's no law against that, so I'm sure. Oh, okay. You're a bitch. Yeah, you're a bitch too. Group of people get into a very heated confrontation with these airline employees all because they felt like they were trying to overcharge them for an oversized bag. I already know some of these airlines try to overcharge you and have all these hidden fees, so they felt like that's what was going on. They was not having it, and that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full clip. You guys, make sure to let me know in the comments who do you feel like is the real Karen in this whole situation. Let's check it out. I've flown four times this year already. Yes, and we do understand that not all Allegiant sites. Can you tell me what the specs are, please? And then what, what makes this an oversized bag? You're because of the, the way size. you see it. Because of the size. No, we need What's the size? Please. What makes this an oversized bag? The size. That's all I have to tell we you. Need the, is the size. Well, we but need the, the size. Calmness. We need yeah. specifications. So just when we fly with the Legion, you can't just you can't Allegiant eyeball has it. To have their rules. Correct. It's an oversized bag. Where does it say that? Okay, I'm not speaking of this anymore. If I, you ask me again, you will not fly today. End of story. This is unbelievable. And you, can, you will not provide your information? No, sir. Your name? I do not have to. You, you don't? Okay. okay. And you can record me. I am. We you. have been. Yes. I, I knew this is so our next crazy Karen was trying to order a pizza online, but they kept declining her card, so she showed up to the location and demanded a free pizza. Yeah, you cannot make this up, guys. Let's check it out. Because they would not deliver to us because the car didn't go through. See, Papa John's pizza. And we see some uh, stuff going down in there. Basically, what happened was is the card wouldn't go through, so they said, well, it's on you. We know that the card works, so we ordered from Domino's, and the card didn't work, or it didn't go through, so they decided to give us the pizza for free. So bring yeah. to us yeah. here at Papa John's. We tried to order from them, and they didn't like his With card, a free right? pizza. See? And Delivery so guy? Wait. They free pizza. him all kinds of names and tell him that it's his fault that his card didn't work. And we, we got over $1,000 for the card. So yeah. you have a problem with it? And you said, we're going to bring you the pizza free. Uh, okay. This dude's telling us that the universe just hates my uncle. His manager here is being a total oh, jackass. Just stop, just close your culprit or something. Yeah, that's what we're going to do, but anyway. Hey, check it out. Domino's free pizza. Thank you. Domino's. Boom. Free pizza. Free pizza. Hey, give this man a tip. Yes. Next woman calls out these crazy Karens for using racial slurs at this pool. Let's check it out. Well, I kind of want to know what it is that you said. Nothing. Nothing. 
Why are you taking it back? I'm not taking nothing back. Then why aren't you saying it? That was so disrespectful and racist. Ignore, she's the one that told us that first of all, we were what? That's the kind of friends you keep? Like, do you believe in that same thing? Do you believe in that too? Do you no? Do you believe in that? Who? Which one of you lives here? My which one? Hold on. Which one of you guys live here? We have their picture. We're gonna submit it. It's fine. Right, just leave it alone. Just it's, leave it alone. Uh, racist comment that my children heard. It's you know what? It's expected. Let's go. Yeah, you're y'all getting recorded. Uh, so this next crazy Karen harasses this woman all because she's Asian. It's 2022 and Karens are still back to their typical shit, guys. Let's check it out. What's your name? Don't touch me. Go ahead and call. What's your name? Don't touch me. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. Bernie, this is your family. The Asian family. This is your mother and father. What the f*** are you talking about? My What's your name? Are Asian. What's your oh, name? My kids are Asian. You don't have to. No, you're, you're racist. If you want to be racist to everyone, why don't you sit down and shut your mouth? She and called she her Asian and she pushed We me. didn't even do anything. We were just walking. Get the f away from me now. You touch me. Assault us, we call 911. Don't talk to me like that. You don't know who touched me first. Who touched you? Who touched you? Who touched you? Who touched you? What's going on? Guys are harassing me. Oh, we have video. Oh, video tape. You need to leave me alone. What do you I, mean? I'm done with we this. We were just walking to the I'm hour walking. Our mom and her daughter. We were just peacefully walking. She uh, turned over and stopped like harassing me. Asian now. bitches. Look at her. We weren't even talking to her. We were right. just having a I'm conversation. Gonna call going to the I need you guys to leave me alone. I'm talking to him. My Shut your mouth. She goes here, okay? <laughs> Our next crazy Karen pulled up to the store and gave these people a really hard time over a discount. Let's check it out. Because one person out of an entire apartment, this entire apartment complex, look at it. No one is ex complaining but you. Aggressive young child. Aggressive? I, I have it on camera. I have you on camera. I really do. I really have you on camera. You see this? Look at this. I, I, there's a Karen. I can't believe I met a Karen. Oh my God. That's incredible. Look, look at this. Look, I can't skate because it's after hours. What am I doing? No one in this entire apartment complex. No one is big, but this. What is this? Look, look I want to hear what this is. I want to hear what's happening. She said I'm skateboarding to the cops. Yeah, I am. I really am. I love skateboarding. I'm, I'm a poser. What's happening? Sorry for the. Oh, he's, starting to, he's starting to come at me. Nope, I'm not. I'm standing right. Come at me right now. I'm coming at her. Yeah. 
I'm. Oh yeah. Yeah, thank you. All right, so our next crazy Karen makes every single person at the Chipotle's life extremely stressful. Karen Let's made it to 2020 to sadly. I love 2022. Then she said the word colored. That's when I got involved. 2022 lit, boy. Going at it. That's why she on TikTok now. Mad. Cause somebody put their hand over this. Fucking crazy ass. Stupid ass. Bye bye, Karen E. Day. Stupid ass. She called him racist, but she called his wife colored. That's racist, stupid. Nobody else said anything but you. So mind your business. I bet they're all thinking. Ah, I don't give a shit. So our next crazy Karen has an epic meltdown after being called out for holding up this line. Let's check it out. Yeah, she wants to go down. Go back to your country and do something. 
Oh, I recorded that. Look at the bear, hell like. You're on 4K. 4K, bro, 4K. Yeah, yeah, look at you. You're a monkey. You're all a monkey. 4K, 4K. This next woman encounters a Karen while feeding the homeless, and you will not believe what happens next. Let's check it out. Hold on, honey, I have enough. Hold on, babies, I have enough, honey. Yeah, right here. Sure. Yeah, give her this, honey. Oh, the Oreos. Thank you. Well, give it another one, honey. Did I give you already? Where? Her? Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. I got more burgers. Don't worry. I got a couple more bags in here. Don't stress. You trying to get some somebody in there? My co-worker and I wanted to get one for her. Oh, here. You can have one for the baby dog. What yeah. you need, my love? My co-worker got something right here. She's Where they at? Sitting down right here by the rest. Sitting down by the rest. Right? Here you go, Queen. Hey, yeah, uh huh. You're welcome, my love. Everybody, I'm passing them out to. They gotta be here, honey, because I gotta finish these people right here. Because they have to be here. Honey. Why am I regulating? Yeah, I used to that for 18 years. And I'm, I'm okay, but I'm regulating because. I'm not trying to. I'm trying yeah, to but if they to, want it, because I have rules. If, if they want to you, you yeah, they have to come oh, to me. Yeah. So that's why I'm regulating. Yeah, I'm regulating. Okay, I don't have anything up, honey. I've been out here for six years doing this, so I'm not. I don't have. I don't have anything. Up. No, you're up. You're up and ungrateful, huh? But I'm giving. She wants me to give her. I gave you four already. Okay, don't go me. Don't go me like that. Don't do that. That is so rude and ugly. Rude. Your behavior is so rude. And you got a problem? You get the f out of here. Who's close for you? You on camera too, miss. Yeah, In good. You're on camera okay. too. And you've been on okay, camera. Miss. You guys have to leave. Okay, we're gonna leave. Okay, you just try to like come really close to me because you think yeah. you're scaring us. Leave now. Okay. Or what? Yeah. Or what? Or this. Would you like to leave? What is that? Did he? Would you like to see what it is? Sir, you're on recording. Leave, uh, leave, leave the premises. Sir, I'm going to call the police on you right now. Don't call them. Uh, so our next crazy Karen is getting to a very heated confrontation at this gas station. Let's check it out. Hey! Hey! Knock it the f*** off! You don't get the f*** off! Knock it the f*** off! Get it back to your goddamn car! What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Take your fucking right to the somewhere else. Take your right to the somewhere else. Crazy Karens get kicked off of this train for causing havoc. Let's check it out. Karens get kicked off a train from Chicago to St. Louis. She tells him, I'm sorry. Yelling and shit, they mad as fuck. 
<laughs> they mad as fuck. They mad as a motherfucker. They are. <laughs> Bye, bitches. Cameron has an epic meltdown at Little Caesars and things got ugly really quick. Let's jump right into it. Regina Leonard. It was eight pizzas. It was eight pizzas. I'm wondering why it was more than 30 minutes late. Because we have several big orders. And I they had in line. one. I ordered at one o'clock this afternoon. I understand that, ma'am, but it goes in line with the way it pops up. I can't stand it. I'm calling corporate. Please do. Because I will. Because, because I want my money back. Orders I want to. Because we had big orders ahead of you, too. Because you, 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 you wasn't the only one that had a big order for you. But you can leave my store. We don't have time. I just want a pizza. That's all I want. Now we can finish our conversation since we all got our cameras up. But it's a shame. I'm a human resource manager. It's a shame that we have to sit here and put cameras up so that I could say, hey, do y'all really ID everybody? And it's you a, said back to me. I gave me, you a yes, simple response. Right. You said, yes, ma'am, I did. And, and I said back to you, as a customer, I think that is crazy. I said, even if people have canes, glasses, yes, and walkers. Yes, we have to every time. Y'all, And yes. And then you proceeded to continuously get smart with me. All I, I was not. doing was asking the policy. And then you proceeded to get mad, pull out a camera and all that. I for told what? you the policy. You could just ended the whole right. conversation no, there. I don't have to end the Wait. conversation because I'm telling you, I'm complaining to you okay, to put in a complaint to corporate. To corporate. It is I'm on the door. We have to ID I'm every single time. I'm not saying you shouldn't. That's where you're getting the wrong, long, wrong thoughts where you need to pull out cameras. Stop being defensive. I'm not saying you shouldn't have that policy. Then don't get mad at me about I'm the policy. I'm not mad about the policy. That's your problem. Who is upset but you? Well, why were you complaining about it? It's not a complaint as a customer. If I'm and you it work, is a complaint can I, as a customer. Can I speak to you real quick? You can leave. You have to. If I'm, get I'm out. Not, no, leave. I'm leave. not leaving because I'm not doing anything okay. wrong, and you can see it on right, the day. So, okay. If I'm a customer and I'm saying, hey, well, I'm gonna, you know the cops have been called. If I'm a customer and I'm saying, hey, I think this is weird that we have this policy. Uh, so this next guy gets into a very heated confrontation with his crazy Karen neighbor after she flipped over his rug because she felt like it was inappropriate. So this guy had a rug that said F off on it and Karen wasn't feeling it. So she flipped it over. And that's when things got ugly really quick. So let's check out the full video. You guys make sure to let us know in the comments what's your thoughts on this crazy situation right here. You are now watching and let's upload Excuse me, ma'am. Can you pick huh? my rug? Back? Can you pick my rug back up? Because I saw that you flipped it over early. It was not bothering you or anyone. Sir, I don't think it's appropriate. It does well, not matter. I live here. This is a. It does not matter what you deem appropriate. Nobody else has said anything about it. That does not give you the right to touch anything on my damn porch. You can go up there and tell your goddamn husband to come see me when I come home. I'll be home at five thirty. Make sure you out. Make sure you're there, ma'am. So you come down and talk. Take your shake ass upstairs. Sir, do you want to talk to me again? How can I help you? Look, I'm not trying to be ugly, and I'm not trying to cause any scene with you whatsoever. We live in a family environment here. I have children here, too. To me, having the F word on your doormat is not respectful of anyone that lives here. And it's not respectful of you to touch my property. It's not bothering anybody. I have my neighbors across the hall. I'll pay you for your mat. I will pay you for your mat. But get that out of here. I don't know what made you change it to something so ugly as that. But I, I'm, I'm not going to. No, you know, that's yeah, not the because I've heard you stand in front of my ring doorbell and talk about me, which was inappropriate of you. When you know, what did I say about you? I haven't can, said anything, ma'am. You can lie to Jesus Christ if you feel that is the truth. I don't care. You have talked about me in front of my ring doorbell. I have proof of it. I have no reason to lie on you, make anything up on you, ma'am. So please, you could just move away from my door. Do not touch anything. You have been reported to the office. Thank you. Have a nice day. Get a life. You get a life, you mad old. I got a life. You don't. Get Apparently, you life. don't, you old heifer. Get on up them steps. Oh, 
His girlfriend came to his graduation to surprise him and snuck up behind them to photobomb one of their pictures. They then tried to show him the picture and he looked real close and just smiled, not even realizing it. They laughed at him and then said look at it again and he finally notices her. His face says it all as he's in complete shock and then broke down in tears as she walked towards him for a hug. Incredible surprise. So I want to thank every single person for tuning in. Make sure to like and subscribe. Until next time guys, more Karens.